Hey guys, welcome back, welcome back. John Megacycle here, another episode of Startopia. Going through the missions here. Uh, yeah, this is a game that I've been playing for, I, I'd say off and on for almost a decade, if not more. This has been one of my favorite games, and it's definitely a different take from the Command & Conquer Generals and other RTSs you're used to seeing me play. This is one I definitely recommend you to pick up. Uh, we're just going through the missions here, and then I think we'll finish off the series with an actual skirmish, but we finished the Grueling Workers' Party, no problem, and now over to the Grey Council. Okay, we have our banner, same deal, an energy collector we're going to fire up, and put this bad boy in the corner, save on some of the space. Works for me, a couple of scuzzers, get these guys online, get them working. Congratulations on your new post. The Grulian Workers' Party were very pleased, and so am I. After all, I deserve some of the credit for your previous success. Now the Grey Council wish to set up a space hospital within this sector, and it is for this reason they've called upon you. You Fantastic. have signed the contract that the Greys insist upon. However, I have checked the microprint, and there are two clauses you must stick to. Firstly, you must cure at least a hundred patients. Secondly, you must keep the mortality rate 10 or less. You'll note a port, droid charger, and power booster have been delivered, along with technology plans to allow the construction of sick bays. Medical supplies have also been provided. Those unblinking fellows, the Greys, have been frugal with the energy they've given you. Make every last bit count. Before the hospital can be fully constructed, you must build the initial facilities. As before, hard plan and technology crates have been provided. Thanks, Val. Recharger, absolutely. I kind of want that more centralized. Power booster, not really too worried about it. No one really uses the power booster, so I don't mind if we stick that in the corner. Now it's this one, a port. Let's see. Don't open. Open with zero. Okay, so that tells me we're going to be expanding this way more... I mean, it's a much greater chance. We're going to put that there. we will be able to keep a lot of these other services centralized. Let's get the recharger there. And then a sick bay. These medical supplies are important to keep the sick bay running. Oh, what does Val have to say the now? The sick bay has been added to your build menu. Oops. This should make things easier. I'd advise not spending all your energy on building a huge sick bay. Start small and wait till more patients come aboard before you expand. I'm gonna do it the exact same way I did before, Val. So, <laughs> I like this setup here. Uh, this one, I think, maximizes enough of the space. There's a little waste, um, but it makes it very uncomplicated. It's very easy to set up. Good walking area, no one gets glitched in. There we go, no problem. Uh, now the what? sick bear has been added to your build yes, menu. Yes, I heard you. This should make things easier. I'd advise not spending... Yes, once you finish building your first sick bay, we can expect patients to begin coming aboard. Remember, only a weak-minded fool spends all their energy on their first sick Holy bay. Holy crap. Keep some aside for expanding later on. Heard ya, man. Heard ya. Okay, birth, lavatron. Now, again, a lot of these facilities I kind of want to keep close, but we're going to be building duplicates anyway. So let's just put the Lavatron there. Dynomat here. Birth here. And then, yeah, we'll be building an extra copy, I'm very sure. Now, can I do just three? The birth I kind of don't mind going a little crazy on, because I'd rather build a large birth than have to build two of them. So let's see, door and door, and this is how this is going to work. That should do. Although I applaud your skill at fitting so much into a small area, it might be advisable to expand into an adjacent segment. Sure. I was actually just going to really wait to see how long before he'd tell me to do it anyway, but that's okay. Our friends the Greys have delivered a berth, Lavatron, and Dynamax. Oh, we already got ahead of that. These can <laughs> be used by your new staff and patients. Very good. So the mortality rate is... 10%. Less than 10%. That's pretty funny. I recommend you purchase and install a comm sensor. This will give you advance warning of emergency situations and influxes of patients. You would be wise to listen to me on this one. 
Uh, let's see. There's no one really exceptional at the moment. We're gonna hire you. I do want to make sure that we're stocked, so... Com sensor. Uh, I didn't get a hard plan for it, did I? Sick bay. Well, this is gonna be a little problematic if I can't build a comm sensor. Oh, medical supplies, right. Those are gonna be required by our medical team. Oh, here we go. Hi. How are you? Still making a success at the illness game, I see? Fancy a glass of mucus wine, nouveau? <laughs> <laughs> no, no. That's Actually, funny. That's Mission one, love. the dude got sick from it. <laughs> Mission two, now you're offering it to me. Oh, a scuzzer, absolutely. Let's see. A recycler would be nice, but I don't have a ton of cash to throw around. Let's stick with what we've got. Let's get this uh, other scuzzer online. Let's get the comm sensor up and running. Very good. Now, let's see if we could find a couple of these tarps. Nope. Uh, let's see, visitors. No, not at all. Uh, yes, your comm sensor is lovely, but you must hire a TARG to run it. Otherwise, it's, uh, how shall I put this, useless. But they're all terrible. Alright. I guess Brizzle Beep. Brizzle Beep Beep. Hey. Nope. You. I guess, uh, you're hired. You have no skill at all, but you're so dedicated. So dedicated! Okay, looking good so far. The Greys expect you to cure 100 patients. Additionally, you must not let more than 10 die. This forms part Cures, of your contract, okay. and the Greys are sticklers for such things. Now cured five patients. Long may this good work continue. There is a solar flare in progress. Shall I reconfigure the collector to gather? The Greys have health inspectors who may visit at any time without warning. These people can close the hospital down if they find that hygiene levels are too low. Be aware. Okay, so once in a while Val can say, can I recalibrate the sensors to collect some solar energy? It's completely free. It's a nice stipend. You see our money just jumping up. It's free cashy cash. So it's important that you pay attention for that message. It looks like the little, um, I don't know, yellow shuriken? A little yellow throwing star kind of a thing. It's supposed to resemble the sun. So it's good that that's there. Now, I don't see a lot of our facilities being heavily utilized, so I'm not really worried about building new structures. I would really like that recycler, and I would really like to get some salt hogs working. But until we really see a huge need for it... Oh, gosh, I need some guys with skill. Doctors, unlike myself, are not perfect. You should check the skill levels of those you hire. Poorly trained doctor is as dangerous as a Carisian proximity mine. Uh, good analogy, I think. Anyway, yeah, it's the exact reason why I wanted to make sure that we were at least two stars hiring those guys in the first place. Ugh. It creeps me out when someone's that dedicated and has, has no ended. skill. Oh, Rona. Hi. How are you? I'm doing fine, thanks. Litter bins. Oh, that would be good. Let's get a litter bin. Recycler prices down. That's good. Actually, we're not drinking all that. Let's get a recharger. Yeah, let's let's start let's start really diversifying what we got going on here. So, hard plan, recycler. Nah, I don't I don't like the way that's no. You get back in. Come on, you can rotate. There we go. There, that's better. Uh, recharger. Oh, let's get this one over here. Since I have so few scuzzers, the very worst thing that could happen is I just run out of scuzzers. Like, they just run out of energy. What'll happen is they'll just shut down, and they won't do anything. So you have to manually pick them up and put them in a recharger. Inspectors have arrived. If the hospital facility is still dirty by the time they leave, we are in serious trouble. Good skill. You're hired. No skill. No skill. Well, hardly any skill. Let's see, visitors. Still nothing. I'm not looking for top dollar, but I need something better than one star here. And I think our facilities are pretty top-notch on the clean perspective. 
as I seen before. Oh yeah, it scares me a little bit when someone has no skill but tons of dedication. It's like, what are you doing? We have incoming casualties. Eight hurt miners are expected soon. Supervisor, brains are so inefficient as data storage devices. You are in danger of forgetting that you need to hire salt hot. Your cured patients will want rest and recuperation. How about providing accommodation and entertainment for them? Your doctors. The Grey Council has provided suitable technology for Holy you crap. to build rest and recreational facilities. Did I tell Just you this was a different kind of hard RTS? I mean, menu. things kick off very quickly. Uh, we're gonna put this one right here. Like, I want all Ten the sick base. patients have been cured now. Excellent work. Let's try that again. Uh, yes, that's correct. Um. The thing is, if this is the name of this mission, is like to make sure everyone's healthy, I'll go a little gun ho on the medical base. I have no problem with that. There's that. Get that online, please. Alright, let's see what this is all about. Music shop, star motel, corridor lamp, bench, general store. Alright. Did you give me access to the second floor? Oh, you did. Fantastic. The pleasure deck on the station is now available for inhabitation. You could nope. build your new facilities on there this deck. Although okay. many facilities must be built on the correct deck, certain ones can be placed on either level. Crap, I don't have enough Dynamat money to do any of that. How are you? Still making a success at it doing this game, I see? The pleasure deck on this station is now available. Okay, the yes. health inspectors are impressed with the extreme cleanliness of your hospital. Hoo -hoo. They award you 10... You know, just the other day, a medical droid acquaintance of mine informed me of the advantages of a dispenser in the curing of carbon-based life forms. I'm sure you're aware of this already and have avoided purchasing one for a good reason. Though I can't think what. Okay. Everyone's very chatty in this game. You have starships coming in for trade. You, cannot be that you got a Rona doll who wants to see what's what. We got some salt hogs we need to hire. We got some more greys we need to hire. We gotta get moving on some of this stuff. And this is where this just gets all hands on deck crazy. Oh, I already hired you? Whoops. That's what I meant. Whoa, Siren, hello. Those are the only ones that have a uh, clear uh, uh, gender, I guess. There's male and female versions, so when I was saying he and they and whatever before. Nope. Oh, yep, you're the one. Okay, there's two. Now, that's three total. That'll work in the recycler. Fine, no problem. Let's get these shops online. Music shop. Or, I don't remember which one I just placed. <laughs> Music shop. Okay, the thing I said out loud is what I did. So, general store. Star Motel. Uh, this is the pleasure deck. It's just as important that we conserve space on this deck as any other, but um, I don't think I'm going to be using the whole mission to use up all that space anyhow. Okay, so there's that. I still need to hire more greys for my second sick bay. One star. No thank you. Visitors. Uh, three stars? A 311? I'll take it. You're hired. I want to make sure we start using up. I want to make sure we have plenty of capacity. I don't want it to be like, oh, you lost someone, build another sick bay. I want it to be like, we always have enough stuff, never a problem. <laughs> Five star skills, zero loyalty. That's kind of funny. Grab, 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 grab. Grab. Supervisor, why not help your scuzzer droids by beaming up rubbish and junk and dropping it directly into the recycler? Val, what the heck do you think I'm doing, man? A menial task. Listen, do you want something useful? Any more scuzzers? I have quite a bit of hospital stuff here that, uh, fell off the back of a trolley. <laughs> There's our scuzzer. Uh, medical stuff, I don't care. This is a dispenser. Out of the type of card. Oh, okay, it's the same kind of thing. So give me this. That can get recycled. There. So you this cannot one. beam that up. Okay, so what you can buy is you can buy better. The Oops. hospital is expecting eight aliens with food poisoning. Be yeah, no ready problem. to treat them. You can purchase better furniture versions of some of these structures. So that's why the dispenser was available. There's also uh, an x-ray scanner. 
Uh, and then a Z-ray scanner. A new alien race has come aboard. They are the sirens. When I saw them, I felt a strange tightening of some of my metal parts. This could be a malfunction. In fact, I'm getting it now, just thinking about their smooth, firm... Malfunction. No, We're rebooting. <laughs> you have successfully treated all the Salt Hog miners. You have received a bonus payment of 15,000 energy. Well done. Very good. Okay. Sirens. Let's talk about them for two seconds. They're the ones that take care of the um, emotional requirements, let's say, of some of our residents. So whenever any of our... Ooh. There is a solar flare yes, in thank progress. You. Shall I whenever any of our residents feel depressed energy. or emotionally lonely, they're able to go and speak with the siren. It's all G-rated. I've been assured it's all G-rated, and uh, they'll be able to get some things off their minds. Oh, you're sick. You're, you have a job the very second you are healed. Come on. Booyah. Cured. Cured with job. Okay. The Greys expect you to cure. You know yep. there was a big banquet last lunar rotation? Well, the feasters have been poisoned by something they ate. The finger of suspicion points towards a bad batch of mucus wine. But let's get the ill diners on the road to recovery before we conjecture further. This is really funny how often that mucus wine is going to be brought up. Okay, I need someone else to run the commencer as well. You're fine. Com sensor. I keep calling it a commencer. It's not a freaking frick. <laughs> Are you any good? No. Instead of doing that, I should just go here. Uh, no one of any decent rapport. Two stars. I'm happy with two stars or more. Anything else really makes me nervous. Okay, there's that. Spectres have arrived. I see you branched out into the health industry. Wise move. People are always gonna be sick. Ooh, a love nest. Okay, this is where the actual sirens do their work. Let's stick with the love nest, and then I'm gonna hope that I get another kicker of money, so that way I can... Wow, you guys look bored. That way I can actually do another power booster or something else. Let's see, let's go something like this. I don't think we need tons of space, but we need love chairs. Let's do three for right now. I don't have a ton of cash. And I don't even have any sirens under my payroll, so... Let's see. You totally hired. Once you're done getting not sick. Oh! Hey! Oh! Hello! You're hired. I'm thinking... Oh! I just got a heck of a you stipend. You have cured all the poisoned banquet guests. Well done. Sweet. Also get a bonus of 15,000 energy, and you and I deserve it. <laughs> and you and I deserve it. Good. That'll keep that very well functioning for a very long time. Now, up here we can also build some of the facilities, but not all of them. Like, we could build a Dinomat and a Labatron, um, but we don't have the hard plans, or we don't have the tech for them. Or the hard plans, really. That was also a true statement. Uh, no. Well, I guess... I'd like to have at least one or two sirens. So this is a very cute little exercise. Someone who's depressed comes here and just has a chat with them. And it's... It's a, um, it's like My Little Pony's kind of adorable, I guess. <laughs> totally G-rated. <laughs> Eight aliens with a contagious disease are expected any minute. Prepare yourself. It sounds like a tongue twister. Eight aliens with a the contagious disease. The health inspectors are impressed with the extreme cleanliness of your hospital. They award you 10,000 energy for your efforts. I, too, must offer hearty congratulations. Although I feel I helped a great deal. <laughs> I'd like your sarcasm chip modified. Are you any good? You have no skills at all. Every bit of trash we pick up is one less bit of trash the Scuzzers have to deal with, and every one bit of trash the Scuzzers don't have to deal with means, um, less trash. So yeah, gonna keep that trend up. Okay, Arona, what you got for me, buddy? Hi. How are you? 
still making a success at your donor's game, I see. Litter bin. That's your glass of mucus wine. Power booster would be good at this point. No? Actually, when I drink it on the... Now, under normal there is circumstances, a solar in progress. Shall I reconfigure under the normal circumstances, the Arona Del does not offer such good deals. We're gonna put the power booster up here. You have run out of the type of cargo. Now, just because we ran out of the cargo, it doesn't mean that we can't perform medical. Like we can't do our job in the medical facility. We'll just create the product ourselves using E. Like it's just automatic. Energy will be deducted from our account and it just goes as is. Not that big of a deal. It's far more economically suitable if you have the product on hand, but we don't. So like there's really not a whole lot we can do about it. Um, I could hire another gray or two. Perfect. You got a job. Oh, what did I grab? I accidentally grabbed the scuzzer at the same time. Looking good, looking clean. I'm really glad I picked up some of those litter bins. The solar flare has ended. The problem kind of takes care of itself if you have those litter bins around, but these some of these alien races are just going to be lazy regardless. Like, some of them are just cleaner than others. No big deal, but it's just something you just have to really be mindful of. So having more scuzzers on board can help. That's why I'm always very excited to talk to my buddy Arona Dahl, make sure that we get some scuzzers online, that sort of a thing. So this has been good so far. We've been able to take care of a constant stream of new sick aliens. We're at 49. So we're almost halfway through our objective and not a single death, which is how that should be played. We're also getting a good couple of kickbacks economically from treating all these patients, because we get 200 E per patient, I believe, and then we get like a little extra. I'm not too sure what the extra is, so it costs 50 for us to pay for the good. But we should have gotten a little, a little. 50 patients in our field. There we go. This milestone means you are halfway there. There we go. 200 plus 65. There we go. So now they're paying for their services. So if you produce the good by yourself, or you have it by normal means, and I think that'll be exposed later how we'll do that, um, it'll be a lot cheaper. I can't open that, can I? No, okay. Listen, do you want something useful? I have quite a bit of hospital stuff here that, uh, fell off the back of a trolley. <laughs> <laughs> oh, the laugh is contagious, but you're not convincing anybody. Uh, medical supplies? Absolutely. Uh, let's get another dispenser. That's been paying off nicely, I think. So, give me that. Put that there. Uh, right in the recycler. Uh-oh. Um, there we go. Oh, no! The dispenser I just bought! Ah. Shoot. All right, well, anyway. Excellent work. The contagious patients were all dealt with successfully, and you have been awarded 15,000 energy for your prompt action. It must be said that you're making an excellent job of running this hospital. I didn't think an organic could be as good at such a tricky task. You'll be after my job next. Or not, seeing as I'm technically your servant. Yeah, good thinking that through. Inspectors have arrived. The hospital facility is still dirty by the time they leave. We are in serious trouble. If you think it's dirty at all now... Warning. Eight beings with blastocephalus are incoming. Oh, blastocephalus. <laughs> There's not any part of that word that sounds any fun. Uh, okay, so here. Emotional redemption. Not to be confused with spiritual redemption. That's what the monks take care of later on. And the monks will actually worry about the religious aspect. The sirens worry about the emotional side. Because a... You have run out oh, of a type of cargo. Yeah, that's fine. Because a people have emotional needs and also spiritual needs. All good, all done. Okay. What can we do about getting some more grays here? I want to make sure that we have a good stock. One star, no thanks. 
uh, really good skills. I mean, once you get healed, you got a job. Oh, now you have a job. Realistically, with a low loyalty, what will happen is after a while, if a uh, peep becomes unhappy with their job or they feel they deserve a promotion and you're not taking care of it quickly enough, they'll just leave. It'll say a uh, peep Your has left the station. Counter now stands at 60. Excellent. Perfect. So a good dedication level is important, but I feel that a higher skill level is far more Supervisor, important. Supervisor, why not help your SCSA droids by beaming up rubbish and junk and dropping it directly into the recycler? Seriously, Val, that's well, exactly what I'm doing. Task. Listen, do you want something useful? Yeah, can I get another dispenser? I have quite a bit of hospital stuff here that, uh, fell off the back of a trolley. <laughs> I still find that really funny. I don't know why. The health inspectors are impressed with the extreme cleanliness of your hospital. They award you 10,000 energy for your efforts. I, too, must offer hearty congratulations. Although I feel I helped a great deal. Okay, our facilities look good. Nothing seems overused. Uh, I don't even have the hard plan... Oh, what's going on here? I, even ha I don't even have the hard plans for additional facilities anyhow, so... I haven't seen this since the year I was created. Beings are spontaneously exploding. You, as a medical person, must incubate and cure this before it gets out of hand. I remember my creator, Dr. Kurt Bifkin, exploded. I was drenched in gloop. Nearly shorted me out. It's a great story. There is a solar flare in progress. Shall I reconfigure the collector to uh, gather some solar yes. energy? Yes, free money? Yes, please. That would be excellent. Okay. no really other greys I'm interested in. Backy Jubbly Ghoulies! <laughs> I mean, that's an awesome name. I wish I was named Backy Jubbly Ghoulies or whatever the heck. Okay. So how many residents do we even have? Oh! Promotion time! After a while, what'll happen is when your workers are working for quite a while, they'll ask for promotion. Um, patients have now been successfully treated. Only 30 more to go. If you don't promote them properly or on time, um, or soon enough, they may just leave the station because they feel that they've been working for long enough. So it's very important that you check the residential tab, or at least that I check the residential tab, to make sure that if someone feels they deserve a promotion, that we take care of that. Now what we can do is we can force promotions. We can give, we can promote someone to the, the highest rank immediately. Ended. But the problem with that is it's fairly expensive to do. We're sitting on a good chunk of cash, so it might be just easy enough to do that, but I'd rather wait until someone demands or at least requests a promotion. Okay. Very good. So far, so awesome. Uh, let's see, we're at 70. Let's just get another diagnosis unit up. I was really hoping that we'd have another dispenser by now, but I'm not too worried about it. Okay, yep, that gets consumed. Let me guess, you're gonna ask for... Ah, dang, he's selling a dispenser. Another scuzzer, please. More medical supplies, thank you. There's our medical. There's our scuzzer. Give me this. That goes away. A little bit. Right there. Here is our new dispenser. Fantastic. Very good. There's more litter. Oh, nope. I bet. There we go. Sweet. Actually, I'm going to take that one back because I don't see a lot of trash over there. Trash is more accumulating up on the second floor here. Which makes sense because they're purchasing a lot of products, goods, and services from these shops. So it makes sense that there would just be more litter. There are eight other worlders with radiation poisoning on their way. We'd better move with this one. You any good? No skill. Ouch. Tough game. Tough game. Pretty sure we're going to hear from a health inspector pretty soon as well. The uranium pods have fractured and some people have been irradiated. We better move fast. Not only are they in a bad way, but they'll pass on the radiation to those they come into contact with. Isolate them with all speed. Whew. Glad I'm not an organic. <laughs> that's fairly, fairly rude. But that's okay. I know he doesn't mean it. Uh, let's see. Visitors. 
Ra Mogan. You are hired. You got skills, and you'll totally pay the bills. It's kind of fun. You can just go through here and just read off some of these names. The random name gener generator is pretty funny. I think my favorite of the Targs so far. Uh, of course, the Salt Hogs. Shuffy Owl Holtnaf. Marty Flafnaf. I've got 80 patients. The excitement must be Dixie Arf Gardner. Brain. Fusty Owl Owl Lugs. Govy Jubble Jubbly Flaff. <laughs> Big Beast Torkel Ganger. <laughs> Lugsy Wangle Juggy Jubbly. <laughs> Anky Gaffin Ganger. Skiffy Coolsley Knox. Oh my gosh, I'm going to offend somebody reading these off. Right. Yeah, it's fine. I'm not worried about the inspector. I'm having fun with the random name generator. Back to this. Okay, Salt Hog's done. Trouble. Grays. Yeah, see, the Grays pretty straightforward. It's it's one word, apostrophe, and another word. It's not too bad there. The Oh my god. Nike Peep Neep. Beasel Pick. Scribble Nip. Meep. 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 <laughs> <laughs> I can't even read these. <laughs> All right, take a break. Take a break. <clears throat> yes, another litter bin. Thank you. Here that, uh, fell off the back of a trolley. <laughs> okay. Uh, litter bin. Supervisor, why not help your scuzzer droids by beaming up rubbish and junk and dropping it directly into the recycler? Or is such a menial task below you? Yeah, we can put that there now. Okay. We had one death so far. We're up to 83. I'm pretty confident we've got this in the bag. Okay, so back to the names. Um, Ipneeps. Scribsmeep. Ipneepsnick. <laughs> Let's go to the bottom here. Ikneepneep. Okay, we're done with you. My head's starting to hurt. You have run out of a time. Okay, they all start with Z. Somlal. Zobeline. Zobnim, Zoodaliz, Zamalam, Zamaliz, Zam. Ugh, holy crap. What about the sirens? Um, not nearly as crazy. So far, the salt hogs really got it. Becky and Quant. <laughs> the health inspectors are impressed with the fantastic of your hospital. I'll be able to retire with how many times those guys are paying energy me. Of your efforts. I too must offer hearty congratulations. Though I feel I help okay. you. So this is a really good time where we should really start working on our residential team. And this is something that we've been bouncing back and forth. I'm sure we have more than eight. Oh, there we go. Promotion. Let's do the promotion dance real quick. Promotion. Nope. Okay, back to what I was saying. Though we have more than eight, let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, 10, we have about 13. That's good enough for eight. So we have four here and four here, so eight stations total. You want way more than eight people? And like I said before, these guys need breaks. Patients have now been cured. You're 10 away from success. <clears throat> I was talking, Val. Thank you. Um, anyways, I was saying, these guys need breaks. They're going to need to use the restroom, get some food, get emotional satisfaction, <clears throat> those sorts of things. <laughs> so they're going to need to walk away from their workstation. So it's important that we make sure that when they come back, someone's already manning the post, or however long they take, to make sure that it's, that it's all occupied. And these dispensers, I don't see anyone really manning these things. So I'm not too sure what the deal with those hey, are. This is a nice hospital. Oh, I wish I was extremely unwell, so you could look after me here. <laughs> yeah, I, I guess. Okay. These litter bins are doing a nice job keeping the trash down, so that's what's important. Ooh, solar flare. There is a solar flare yes. in progress. Shall I read? Great. You cured all the radiation victims. A 15,000 energy bonus is yours for such good work. I'm... I'm getting dangerously close to filling on capacity. Because once you hit 100,000 energy, it just gets wasted. So I want to make sure that we just build a couple more structures here. Yes. Oh. Hey. I wasn't done with that. Yep. And... Yep. And, yep. 
Very good. So we paid for the hard plans. They're there. They're going to be constructed. That's good. Ooh, do we have any other sirens that are of value? No. I don't mind hiring sirens that are not 100% on their skill. Um, because what will happen is the peeps will walk away unfulfilled, which is more important than being dead. So, like I said, if you hire a couple of doctors that are not of good skill, they could be injured further or that kind of thing. So, it's like I'd rather be sad than, you know, missing an arm kind of a thing. I guess if you could see it that way. Very good. Getting that early sick bay up was a key, key thing to do. I'm pretty sure of that. We only have one death. We're going to hit our 100% quota. Or our 100, the solar flare has oh, ended. Our 100 survivor quota. 100 cured patient quota. Whatever. I wish I could build more facilities, but they didn't give me the hard plans. And I guess I didn't think of buying them through Dahl. Either way, one more patient, call us a done deal. It's amazing when you play like a skirmish of this, how absolutely frantic it gets. I mean, look how large the station is in the upper left. There's tons of room. When you get three or four players on this thing, it gets a little crazy. You have run out of brilliant. 100 patients have been cured. The Greys will be ecstatic. If they have any emotions at all, that is. Still well done. Hooray. I offer you my heartfelt metallic congratulations. You have completed this level. I did think that you would be too squeamish to deal with the illnesses of the frail, pulpy, and fragile life form, but you've done well. Let's see whether you're capable of performing as well for the TARG. They wish to speak to you about employment, you know. Very good. Well, thanks for joining me, guys. Episode 2 for Startopia, and I'll see you next time.